What cases are you using your liquid embolic for? I think first and foremost, we're looking at peripheral hemorrhage. I think when we see active bleeding on a trauma angio, so let's say pelvic angio, renal angio, anything like that, we're very quick to grab liquids. And so I think that the DMSO-based liquids, like lava, for example, does a really nice job at being able to administer it quickly and to maximally fill the space and stop bleeding quickly. Now, I think all of us would probably argue that we're really fast at what we do, but no matter how fast you are, it takes time to put in multiple coils. And as people who put coils into vessels, it's pretty rare to have one coil occlude a vessel. So it's normally a couple of coils and that just takes time. But grabbing a liquid and putting it through a catheter that's appropriately positioned, even if you're injecting it very slow. And for lava, we do advocate that it be used very slowly. The reality is that you're still going to be faster than putting in multiple coils. And therefore, in a patient who needs us to work quickly, this is probably one of the fastest ways we can accomplish that goal.